Ron, authorities in Mobile County are searching for an escaped inmate with a violent history. Billy Joe Turner is on the loose tonight after he walked away from work release duty in Creola. Local 15's Jasmine Williams joins us now. Jasmine, deputies say he should not have been out in the first place. Yeah, that's right, Greg Kim. He was supposed to be serving a lengthy sentence behind bars. Instead, he was on the side of the road working when he just took off. He's a danger to society and he needs to be found and walked back up. Two days and counting, Billy Joe Turner, a violent career criminal and con, on the run. A manhunt in Mount Vernon and Criola underway to get him back behind bars. He's got a violent history and a very lengthy drug history. Snapshots from his arrest records date back to 1998. Dozens of mug shots, 33 different charges, many including assault and robbery. Somehow, after his latest arrest, he made it out of prison and into the work release program. Early Wednesday, while on the job in Criola, he took his chance and took off, calling someone police believe to pick him up. Those who know the man, the criminals, say the present danger is real and they want him back in custody. Should not have been one of these type of people that are eligible for work release. But how does someone with this arrest record qualify for work release? According to the Alabama Department of Corrections, they are responsible for choosing who gets in the program, and inmates near the end of their sentence are eligible. Turner, however, served two years on a 15-year sentence and was scheduled for a parole hearing in August, set to be released in 2019. Local law enforcement hopeful this time, with this next arrest, he won't walk away so easy. And the Mobile County Sheriff's Office is assisting in the hunt for Billy Joe Turner. When he is arrested, he will face additional charges. Kim? Jasmine, thank you.